today's show we're talking about stouts. We have our uh, New Belgium Brewery Lips of Faith series. This is the Imperial Coffee Stout. And my guest today is Eric Light. Welcome. Oh, thank you. Uh, tell us a little bit about this beer in particular. Uh, well, so this one is an Imperial uh, Coffee Chocolate Stout. Uh, so it's a little, well actually a lot maltier, a little higher alcohol than uh, kind of your normal run of them in middle beer, beers. Um, about 9%. Yeah, so it's, it's definitely up there. Um, it's, it's, in more than the alcohol flavor, you get a lot of the actual malty roastiness from it. Um, and Lips of the Faith is actually um, one of their the craft series from New Belgium. So a lot of people know them from uh, Fat Tire and some of the mainstream beers. Um, but Lips of Faith, they actually have a, uh, a whole line of really exclusive beers that have um, from sours to stouts. Some that are really nice in the wintertime. And so the reason these are kind of nice in winter is um, when it gets to the colder months, you want something that's going to kind of warm you up a little bit. And some of these nice roasty flavors kind of give that imagery of fire. Um, and also just a higher alcohol is always kind of nice to, to stay warm in the wintertime. Excellent. And you brought a couple to share as well for other variations of winter beers, not necessarily stouts. Uh, right. So, yeah, there's a whole, whole slew of uh, winter beers. Uh, kind of the, the more mainstream version would be um, beers that are kind of brewed with actual spice you would have in some of your winter dishes. Um, so we have, uh, for example, the uh, Winter Solstice uh, by Anderson Valley has... Um, all spice, black currant, cinnamon, and you get a lot of this whole festive uh, flavors out, out of it. And that one is a pale ale or a wheat? Or? Um, well, it's kind of generic. It just kind of says ale, but I'd say kind of American strong ale type flavor. Okay. And then the other? Um, so another one we have uh, from another great brewery out uh, out west is Great Divide. Um, so they're hibernation ale. So this one doesn't have um, any of the, the spices, um, but it has, again, the whole nice warming English strong ale feel to it. Um, so it's a great thing to kick back by a fireplace and have a nice warming beer. Well, thank you so much for sharing with us. Cool. Cheers. Thanks for having me. Hope you enjoyed the show. For more information on Beerhead, please visit us online at meetup.com. Search Beerhead. Thanks.